Well, hello everybody. It is I, Mark Yilday from InsuranceSalesControl.com, InsuranceSalesControl.com. And uh, today we're going to be talking about this training, the two most important things for getting insurance sales. The two most important things in anybody's insurance business without which you will fail. And interestingly enough, it's also uh, something that people don't really focus on as much as they should. Now, what are these two things? Well, setting appointments with qualified people and holding appointments with qualified people. It's not rocket science, but it is very effective. Unfortunately, the insurance trainers have neglected to tell us about this. As a matter of fact, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> as a matter of fact, um, uh, for years, insurance companies have taught us how to sell insurance the same way, uh, unchanged for 70 years. Uh, and the problem is everything else around us, as you know, has changed. And they neglect to focus on how to get the people to talk to and actually talk to them. Uh, insurance companies do a pretty decent job, I would say. And once you get those people to give them a sales track or give you a sales track to sell their product or service. But the problem is nobody tells you how to get these people to talk to in the first place. And I think it's a really important aspect of anybody's insurance business. So what is the easiest way to get people to want to meet with you and actually meet with you to talk about insurance? And today, the best medium is social media. And there are a lot of ways you can capitalize on this to get your message across. As a matter of fact, if you take a look at what's happening now in social media and compare it to like 1960s with Mad Men era, um, the folks would pay a lot of money to get their message across, uh, kind of like throwing spaghetti at the wall and seeing what sticks. They paid millions of dollars for this. Now we're at a time where we can literally micro-target the exact people that we want to talk to, the perfect fit for our product and service, and for a few pennies, have them watch a two-minute commercial, essentially, in the form of a video, or read a brochure in the form of a post. And people want to engage with these on social media like they could never do before. So let's talk about Facebook as one method to do this. A lot of people use Facebook to get uh, leads, and that's okay, except the leads really don't pan out a lot, and there's a reason for that. It's because people don't understand the dynamics of going after the right audiences and targeting the right people. So uh, let me explain. I have my, my handy dandy board, whiteboard today, and I'm gonna show you why that is. Now imagine if your ideal world, your, your, your ideal people to sell insurance to, we're in this bucket. And this is kind of a sad looking bucket, but it's a bucket nonetheless. Now let's say the top, top of the people here, the top, top amount of the people, kind of like cream rising to the surface, this, this top amount here, which is about 5% of the overall population, this 5% or so are going to be ready to buy now or within 30 days. The problem that we have is everybody wants to target these people. So as a result, you're not just targeting them, but practically everybody else in the industry is targeting them. So as a result, by everybody targeting this, this top 5%, the people who want to buy now or within 30 days, it becomes very expensive to compete with that. And as a result, the quality of that opportunity goes down. So, what do you do? Well, let's talk about the next level. The next level of people, which represents about 50% of the total population here, that, that next level of people is about 50% of the population. And while this 50% is not going to go right away, they are going to buy within the next 90 days or so. So what does that tell you? Well, it tells you two very important things. First of all, everybody's trying to target that type 5% that want to go now. Second of all, nobody's paying attention to that 50% of the entire population that will buy within the next 90 days. It's just nobody's paying attention to them. So the key is not to go and target the easy. The key is to target the next level, the 50% that are going to go in the next 90 days or you know, four, three or four months from now. But we'll go. And then everybody else are people who may buy over the next year. Now, what we can do that's different with Facebook that we can't do with anybody else is we can actually 
and, and don't forget about these people, by the way. I'm not suggesting you should forget about that population, but, but target these people. So how do you do that? Well, you create content for them, that specific crowd. So how would you go and create content? Well, um, you'd have to look at it from a different viewpoint. Not trying to sell them, but trying to get them to understand that they're going to have a problem. So a great example of this I use all the time is if you were a roofer, um, you know, you usually get a phone call when people have a problem. They have a big leak in the roof or the roof caves in. Well, that's this top 5% here. But what do you do with these people if they don't have a problem with their roofs? Well, in New England, we have winters and we get icicles and that creates what's called an ice dam. And an ice dam is when you get a bunch of icicles that freeze your roof and it literally opens up a big seam and then, you know, critters and everybody gets in. Well, you start talking about that ice dam. You start talking about the symptoms of an ice dam. Like if you have uh, excessive amounts of icicles on your, your, your roof this year, um, you, may be, you, you may be in danger of an ice dam. And uh, we have a 10 point inspection that we can give you for that. Uh, so you, if, if it is, we're gonna show you what, what to do to stop it. And if it's not, at least you have the, the understanding that uh, you're all set. So in insurance, how do you get that same messaging across in insurance? Well, for the top 5% of the people who are ready to buy now, you know, everybody's competing against there. It's something like, get a quote. Let me quote your homeowner's insurance. Let me quote your commercial insurance. Let me quote your Medicare supplements. Let me quote your life insurance. Well, everybody's doing that. And people are going to say, okay, but it's not really a solid client opportunity. It's a lead. And leads, well, in my opinion, the typical lead, whether you cultivate it from Facebook yourself or you buy them, are mostly a big cup of suck and a waste of time. They're very expensive if you buy them and you have to hope to hell that they pan out and most of them won't. So we really have to change our messaging to meet that 50% who are going to buy over the next 90 days. And there are ways to do this. Instead of saying, you know, get a quote for Medicare, um, you know, one of the, the great ones is the five things you need to do before you even think of signing up for Medicare. And then you put them into a training that teaches them something of value about Medicare, okay? For uh, life insurance, um, it would be, you know, how do you use life insurance to pay for your child's education? And how do you use life insurance to uh, pay for your mortgage? And how do you use life insurance, et cetera, et cetera. So you're not selling them, you're actually getting them interested in the product or service and what it can do for them for the future. Um, the, the commercial insurance is another great one, you know, and, and every time there's a big disaster, there are a lot of commercial insurers, insurees, that have been not paid because their claims are not payable, because they forgot one little thing in their policy. Uh, so in the Midwest, we had tons of floods. Uh, Houston, two years ago, there were tons of floods. Not only homeowners, but, but businesses with commercial insurance, 80% of those people did not get their claims paid. 80% the claims were denied because they didn't have this one thing in their policy. Now, wouldn't you like to know what that one thing is that was literally a few cents extra a month that could have saved their entire business, the lives of them and their family, and the lifestyles of all their employees? The answer is yeah. Well, you know, click here and I'm going to take you to a video and I'm going to teach you all about that. And that is a much stronger way to go after new client opportunities then is to just, you know, uh, get a quote, get a quote, get a quote, get a quote. So one of the things that we do is that we use two things for our clients that really gets 10 times the results of new client opportunities. And when I say new client opportunity, I really mean somebody who's engaged with you and they want to do business with you. You're literally primed and ready to do business and they actually set up an appointment. So for our clients, we put them through different um, campaigns that are meant to step-by-step step, take somebody and get them to request an appointment with our clients. So literally it's from a total stranger, cold traffic, to getting an appointment to talk about buying the type of insurance that our clients are selling. And we do this two ways. We actually install this using two tactics. The first is the proper messaging, just like I told you. We message for an opportunity as opposed for a sale. We message to engage. We don't message to sell, we message to engage. 
And during that engagement process, we also pre-frame the sales specifics. Um, we install buying criteria and give them a sense of urgency to hurry up and just get this now before, before something happens. Um, the other tactic we use is called retargeting. Now, retargeting is a term that some of you may or may not be aware of, but retargeting essentially is um, when somebody looks at some of your content, um, you can actually put a little piece of code so you can tell what they've seen. So if you post a piece of content that's a video and somebody watches the video, then you're gonna know that that person watched the video. And then you set an ad for the person who watched the video. So in most of the campaigns that, that are successful for our clients, um, there's a little piece of information, you know, get this piece of information, and then there's a thank you page where they actually uh, say your, your piece of information is on your way to your email, please check your direct box, it'll be there in a few minutes. While you're waiting, watch this important video. And there's a one, two, three minute video that explains about what they're doing, product, service, et cetera, et cetera, um, with uh, a, a button that they can actually schedule an appointment to talk to you about it. So if you're dealing with life insurance, they can schedule for life. If you're dealing with um, commercial, they schedule for commercial. If you're dealing with homeowners, they schedule for homeowners, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So each time somebody sets an appointment, that's taking somebody from cold to somebody who's willing to talk to you and wants to talk to you about buying your product or service. And if they go to that second page and watch a few seconds of the video and then leave, well, we can go back to them in the future and say, hey, we noticed that you stopped buying at the report on whatever it is that you're offering as far as your insurance, and you didn't sign up for the free no obligation phone call. So click below to do that. And if they don't do it, you can send a different message a week later and so on and so on and so on. As a matter of fact, you can have an entire campaign with different pieces of code on different levels to have a behavioral based campaign that can have 20, 30 or 40 steps. So if they watch the video, but only watch half of it, you can go and say, hey, we noticed you watched the video, but you didn't get to the end and the end had an important piece of it. You can rewatch the video here, or if you'd like, you can schedule a call and I can walk you through the steps. So it's that type of marketing that's working. And retargeting just takes that one opportunity and 10 times the opportunity to put more content, more helpful advice in front of that prospective client. Makes sense? Yeah. Now, what if you were able to just improve a little bit of what you're doing in your, in your prospecting and new client seeking, and you were able to get a handful of new appointments a month? What if those new appointments turned into one client? What would that one client be worth to you? What would a new client every week be worth you? An extra client every week or two extra clients every week? So what would four to eight, maybe 10 new clients a month be worth to you and your family? That's the power of social media marketing is expanding on what you're doing and having the marketing done, not just by you, but by the automation while you're sleeping. And that's a game changer. So what would that really do for you and your lifestyle. I mean, if you're group insurance, obviously that amount's going to be bigger. But if it's just selling life insurance and you get an extra two or three thousand dollars a month, what's that going to change for you? Well, uh, for most people, it will change a lot. And really, truthfully, in insurance, you only need one new case, just one new case to change your entire life. And I know this because it happened to me. Back when I made changes and what I was doing and, and um, literally put those changes in place, within 30 days, we closed our first big case. And that case was worth over $1 million in commissions. Now, full disclosure, I did not get to keep those commissions. That was kept by the agency for the most part, but, but I got my fair share and did pretty well. The point is, it not only changed my life, it changed the entire direction of the company. And that is a pretty powerful stuff. So it's only going to take one big opportunity to change your life and, and your company and in a good way. So, um, you know, as you know, we're in a promotional period and uh, we are putting together training to help you with this social media marketing. And we call it Social Media Bootcamp. Now, the Social Media Bootcamp is going to open up at the end of the month and people are already coming into it. There are 25 spots available. So if it's something that you really want to learn how to do, 
um, I want to explain what's in it. Uh, the Social Media Bootcamp is a three-part Facebook masterclass that shows you all aspects of how to go and do what we just talked about doing uh, very easily. Um, and we also have included some other parts to it that we feel are important. We have a high value client targeting system that we want to walk you through how to effectively target people. And we also have an Instagram secrets to kind of double the effect from Facebook to Instagram. And a lot of people said, oh, my clients aren't on Facebook. My clients don't use Instagram. Bullshit. They do. There are over 270 million people a day in the United States that use Facebook and Instagram. And that means your client is on there. You may not be on there, but your client definitely well is. And the key is to understand how to put messages in front of your clients in their newsfeed so they're compelling. Think about that. Uh, we're also going to include an ads library and some campaigns. And that means regardless of what line, whether it's commercial insurance, personal lines, auto life, home, we're going and group benefits too, we're going to show you how to put these campaigns in place. As a matter of fact, we have a library and a bunch of templates. You can literally cut and paste all this stuff so you or somebody on your team uh, can get these ads up in an hour and start getting new client opportunities for you or if you're an agency, for your, your agents. Um, we also are going to go to a client acquisition funnel training and that's something that we've added to this an extra week where we're going to show you the different back-end funnels because a lot of people don't realize um, it's not just the initial ad that works, it's everything that happens behind that, which is what I just explained. So we can actually show you how to put these together. And in fact, we have templates of these digital sales funnels in place that you can cut and paste and put to work right away. Uh, we've also going to um, put these in place with coaching. And every week we're going to get on the phone to make sure that you understand each aspect of this. Um, while you're doing it, we're going to be on the phone until everybody's answers uh, have been addressed uh, or everybody's questions have been addressed. Uh, we're also going to give you access to our uh, student only group, which really is going to be powerful because these students uh, are going to be, you know, some are going to be killing it and you can ask them questions about that. Um, obviously, if you're in the same town, they may not want to share that, but most of the time they share it, they're fine with it because of different parts of the country, different markets. So if you're interested in learning how to consistently and predictably get a stream of new client opportunities, um, I would suggest that you go to insurancesalescontrol.com forward slash schedule, insurancesalescontrol.com forward slash schedule and schedule a call. And uh, on the call, I will lay out a social media strategy for you based on your specifics. Um, and if it's something you'd like to enter our boot camp with and, and learn how to do all of it on your own, uh, if it's a good fit, if you're the right fit, I will extend an invitation after our call. Now, this is really not for people who are afraid to take action. Um, this is not for people who are scared to try new things because part of learning is actually doing. You can learn how to do all this great stuff, but if you don't put it in place, you're never going to get results. And it's the results that you're after. Um, so it's not for people who are afraid uh, to take action. It's also not for people who are always broke. I mean, you know, listen, I'm broke. I don't have any money. I don't have any of this. If you're broke and you don't have any money for food, you've got bigger problems, ironically, than this. And ironically, it is something that you should think about entering as a student because you need to if you have problems with money. It's a kind of an oxymoron type of thing. Um, it is for people who know they can do better. It is for people who un understand the power of social media and they just want a credible place to learn because let's face it, you get a lot of people out there that bought some kind of book on Facebook marketing and say, oh, I'm doing Facebook ads now. And, and you see this all over the place. These guys are full of crap. This is bullshit. They have no experience in insurance whatsoever. Uh, they have no experience in selling whatsoever, but somehow they're going to make you a fortune millions of dollars. Now, I'm not saying you're going to make any money because we're just going to show you how we do this for our clients. And if you don't take the steps to do what we're telling you to do, and you're not going to get any results. But if you do take these proven blueprinted campaigns and customize them for your own business model, you will get results. That I guarantee. Um, it's also going to people uh, really who um, are just looking for that, that blueprint, that just looking for that step one, step two, step three, step four, step five, you do this, here's how it works and here's how you set it up and then bang, it's up. It's for people who want to take action. It's the people who want to grow their business. So if you're interested again, the social media bootcamp uh, opens up on the, uh, the end of the month, the 30th, 
and it's got 25 spots and four are taken right now so it's only got 25 spots um, go to insurancesalescontrol.com forward slash schedule and uh, see if it's right for you okay uh this is mark illay and uh, before we go i get get some questions uh one of the questions i got is the cufflinks and yes i have cufflinks this is uh this cufflink right here is a big giant one with a boat. Now the reason it's a big giant one with a boat today is because it's pouring rain, like like a lot of rain, like Noah next door is building an ark type of rain. So I figured I'd be appropriate and get this. Um, another question I had uh, was on the back end. You know, when we talked about in one of the trainings uh, how we do what we call a multiplier client stack campaign, which we go and we automate different things to get to the same result. And they asked what so what software do I use? Well, you can use any software that does it. You can use something like MailChimp. Um, you can use Active Campaign. You can use Actionetics. Now, these are the software that people who are in marketing understand, but you really don't need all that software. And everything that we're going to show you in the training, we're going to show you where to get this stuff and show you where to get a free trial. So you're not going to have to pay for it to try it. So you can literally take everything we're teaching you, put it into action, and get results without spending any money for it. Go figure. Um, so with that, um, I want uh, I want to say thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoy this. I hope you got some information from it. That's why we're doing these. Uh, and until tomorrow, I'm going to be back with a different training. Don't have just a great day. Have yourself a gill day. And uh, we'll see you later. Bye-bye.